there folks and happy Saturday to you. It's lovely to see you all again as usual and I hope that I find you very well and you've had a good week. So welcome back to What's For Tea and our family food and bagging for this week. And as you can see, I've gone to Aldi and also Tesco. I love Aldi, but you just can't get everything that you need in Aldi or Lidl for that matter, unfortunately. So we do end up having to go to Tesco or Sainsbury's or Morrison's or somewhere else. So this week we've gone to Tesco for the extra few bits and bobs that we needed. So it's just over £72 between Tesco and Aldi. So it was £20 and 80p in Tesco and then 51 27 in Aldi. No butcher this week. I didn't need the butcher. I've still got meat and things in the freezer which I'll need to use up. So first up we've got our usual tatties. I've been using the Red Roosters for a couple of weeks now and they are great. They're just a wee bit dearer and you don't get as many but they are really good. Some Parmesan cheese and some mozzarella and cheese mix. A big block of the Red Leicester. I haven't had the Red Leicester for a wee while. And then a double cream. I'm going to be doing Tuscan chicken pasta. So I need the cream for that and the Parmesan actually. And then some Flora buttery just for a change from the butter couple of yogurts so I got the cherry large pot yogurt and also our usual mango papaya and passion fruit I get this every week you know everybody loves this it's lovely and creamy and then some bananas as well but I will need to pick up more bananas because I'm eating bananas as well now so we go through a lot more than normal and then some red dusty grapes we've been loving grapes as well over the past couple of weeks and then I got some iceberg lettuce. I was looking for a whole iceberg. They didn't have any at all. So I just got the stuff in the bag. So that's fine. And then some mini peppers as well, just for salads and sandwiches. And these wee ones are great because you don't have to open a whole pepper and maybe just use half of it. So those all get used quite quickly. And then some chestnut mushrooms. And then some of these wee vine ripened tomatoes, some tender stem broccoli. We love the tender stem. And then a parsley plant as well. And this one is lovely and vibrant and green. I found that the, the, you know, the, the wee plants in Aldi are always lovely. And then some beetroot as well. And these are massive. I love beetroot. That's the natural one without the vinegar. Picked this up from Old El Paso thinking it would be a good lunch option for me. But this is really, really high in calories. I didn't think it would be quite in high, you know, quite as high as it is. So I might have to put that one back into the cupboard for a wee while. And then some chicken for the Tuscan chicken pasta that I'm going to be doing. Some garlic bread slices. I like to put this into the freezer and I just pull out the slices as I need them. Some blueberries because I've been having porridge oats and milk in the morning and I just pop a few blueberries in for a wee bit of sweetness. I'm going to be doing jammy dodger biscuits. So I needed some good jam, what I call good jam. So that'll do it for that. Again, for the Tuscan chicken pasta, I need the sun-dried tomatoes. Tomatoes. So I picked those ones up. Those are in oil, so it works really nicely with the pasta. Some cayenne pepper. I'm not using as much of this as I used to because I'm fed up being told off. So I just got the one jar. Some Hellman's light mayonnaise. This is a nice lighter alternative to the high calorie stuff. And then some olive oil. This is getting harder and harder to find at a decent price. So that's a blend of olive oil and vegetable oil. Some hula hoop puffs. And then for me, for the snack drawer, I've got these wee fibre one donuts. I have had them before. They're not my favourite, but they are nice, you know, just as a wee sweet treat. And you don't overeat them because they're not that nice. And then two packs of the tea cakes as well. I was looking for the larger pack. They didn't have it. So I got two of the smaller packs. And then some rigatoni as well just to fill up the pasta tub. I'm just about out of the rigatoni. And this is a nice alternative to the penny. Some tomato soup as well for a cheeseburger pasta bake. And then some cooking salt. I add this to vegetables or potatoes or, you know, that kind of thing as they're being boiled. It's not, I don't use it as table salt. I just use that as cooking salt. Some frozen sweet corn. I add this to absolutely everything. I love it. And then some frozen peas as well. Some beef dripping chips. These are our favourite chips to make in the air fryer. But you just don't get many in the bag. But they are lovely. 
in my usual big bag of jacket potatoes. Those, you know, you just can't go wrong with those. I know they're dear, but they're great just in a hurry. Some mini eggs for the snack drawer and then a big bag of the dairy milk buttons. These are amazing as well. And you get loads in the bag. Some bleach just for down the toilets and then some furniture polish as well. And then the nine roll of the toilet paper or toilet tissue, however you prefer to say it. So that's everything that I got from Aldi and Tesco. And like I said, that will see us through for the week ahead. But I do do wee top up shops throughout the week as well for things that I might have forgotten about or things that were run out of. So there are additional things on top of that. So thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate that. And for the supporters over on Patreon and to the channel members here on YouTube as well, it's all very much appreciated. And thank you all for watching and leaving your lovely comments and for those that share the videos as well. And I will be back during the week on Thursday for a wee recipe, back on Sunday, which is tomorrow, for our family meals of the week, or even back this time next week for another food shopping and bagging but whenever you choose to join me have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll catch you off as soon back here on what's for tea and I'll just leave you here with the beautiful whiting bay and Aaron so you take care and bye for now bye now